All right, yep. I'm gonna I'm gonna read this super chat and then I'm gonna let you say what you was about to say. Perfect. Uh, we cannot do this. Says as a man, it is strange to hear other men take. Excuse me, as, as a man, it's strange to hear other men not take accountability. This is sick. Ask what the issue was and was with the black community, and I was sent to this channel. What? Well, you know what? We cannot do this because you're a white guy and you want to see things a certain way. The truth. The truth is hard for you to accept. All you gotta do is sit back and listen. They sent you here for a purpose. You, you are literally paying to complain about what black men are attempting to do to salvage the wreckage of our families, of our communities for generations. Uh, policies that were enabled, voted by, supported by your kind. Mostly because we can't black people cannot make law and exclusively make law and policy and court decisions in this country where we're 13 percent of the population. Uh, black men are only probably about five percent of the electorate. You all will you all pass laws, make ju uh, judicial decisions, enforce police uh, uh, criteria, all of which impacting black communities everywhere. And then gentlemen like you get to come and blame everything we're doing on us, even though all of it has been imposed by people who look like you. You know, I, I off, there's, there's often a lot of controversy about how black people, black men in particular, should view and treat uh, white people. Uh, and, and there, there's a lot of complexity there because in the end we're in this country with you and to some degree we've got to have some comedy in order for us to peaceably coexist but um it's really sad and shameful what you people are and what you people have done for for the better part of a thousand years it's really sad and shameful and what's what's most sad and shameful about who you are and what you've done is nobody can stop you or fix you from the devils you made of yourselves and continue to make of yourselves. You can't be, we can't cure you of it. The, the, peop, the people who've gotten closest to trying to cure you of your devilment have been black people. Any sort of humanity in this damn country has had a black man fighting for it, die, bleeding for it, dying for it any right any privilege of american you cannot separate black people from that and then your ancestors most of which came to, from europe long after ours did benefit from those very same criteria that black men fought bled and died for and then your ass get to come 100 150 years later and then condemn us for all the policies and all the decisions that you yourself have enforced so to that, I would just say, if you're going to be, continue to be here, at least continue to pay us for it, as you did. Thank you very much for your donation. And, and let me also say uh, to this, the issue that you have, your personal issue is you don't know what accountability looks like. That's why when you hear it, it's making you sick. See, you don't like black men standing up for themselves and actually taking responsible for what's, what they've done. And it bothers you. And that's the that's the truth. You you say you want stuff. You say you want to see certain things. Now you see in here, and it's bothering you because black men ain't coming to you and your people trying to figure out how to fix what's going on with us. That's what your real problem is. You want us to come to someone like yourself and ask y'all how we supposed to fix us, and we have no intention. And no no, we're not even thinking about y'all. <laughs> you're the here judging us. Meanwhile, your own women are turning against you. Your own women are turning against you. Can I can I can I say something real quick? Uh right now the leading the leading uh the leading group of single single mothers is what is white women. So you know and increasing go, uh, and increasing right, increase. it's the fastest growing, right? So you know, maybe maybe you should send a super chat about that, bitch ass <laughs> white nigger. Well my thing is at, at, <laughs> at the at the end of the day, 
I'm not going to let the show be about him because that's what he wants at the end of the day. This this is somebody who wants attention. He said, I thought bl black men were good yesterday. We were good yesterday. We good today. And we're going to be good tomorrow. Oh, yeah. The thing is, we're great. You to be good. We're great. Your only, your only issue is we don't need you. And that's really what's bothering you. We don't need mm -hmm. you. We're not asking you for anything. We're not looking for your permission for anything. Mm. And we're not looking for your guidance on anything. Because you can't do nothing to help us. And yeah. honestly, I understand you want to be smart. And I don't mind you sending money. But if you were somebody I really need to concern concern myself about, your super chats would be bigger. And that's just real talk. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, but but he can do one thing. Keep those ratchet ass white women out of good, decent black man's face. That's what you can do. And off their dicks. Which is almost impossible, but go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> and and we're going to move on from that. Uh, Kevin, <laughs> since you done came up, you got it, my brother. How you doing? <laughs> hey, hey, good morning to everybody. Uru, Hot Sauce, Perfect Timing, Roger, uh, the panel, the well, chat. You know what, Kevin, see, let, me, let me do this real Salute. quick. Yeah. He actually sent one more in. <laughs> he said, it's the fat, the fastest going on with biracial children. But see, yeah, I, and, see, and those I, are black know, women having biracial children with white men. I, I beat them to the punch. I beat them to the punch. Yeah. I said, keep the ratchet ass women out of black community, right? So before he texted, I said it. So you slow, <laughs> motherfucker. You slow. I beat you. <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah, brother. That's that you want to talk to your women about that. And thank you to Taipan. He says, bring your <laughs> bring your fortune, your fortune, friends. Thanks for the donations. Hey, appreciate it, brother. Appreciate that, Taipan. Uh, yeah, so. Bro, as a white dude, man, if if you actually want to be helpful, sit back and listen. Uh, send some money, but you probably just want to send some super stickers instead of super chats because you're not putting anything that means anything in these super chats. Okay, but I do want your money. I do.